Basement Nation Outdoors improvised medical series where we're going to go through some quick tips using common supplies that you may already have when you're out hiking, hunting, or fishing. Today we wanted to give you a quick tip on how to prevent and treat blisters um, that you may already have or that you're feeling coming on and you want to prevent. Well, the supplies that we commonly will have in our, you know, in a backpack is maybe a sandwich bag, some tape, or some adhesive and you know something to kind of help prevent the friction of your skin with your sock or your boot. So most of us will be carrying you know a little sandwich bag or some sort of plastic. Um, I have a sandwich bag that I'm going to show you how to make this bandage. I have duct tape which if you don't carry duct tape then you're a fool. Um, so what you want to do is you're actually going to cut the corner out so that you're going to fit it over your heel, tape it on, pull your sock on over it, and then put your shoe back on. And that's going to prevent, you know, rubbing and friction. It's going to develop that blister further, or you know, it's going to reduce the pain if you already have a blister there that's worn. So, first thing is cutting, you know, a square, another 90 degree, out of your little plastic bag. have a nice little square piece here that's going to fit over your heel. So the other thing that you want to do between your skin and the plastic is some sort of lubricant, you know, some water which won't hold up as well, but you know, I just have some nasty chapstick <laughs> out of my truck, sparkly too. But you just want to kind of get a little film of just inside so that you don't mess up where it has to adhere. And then you just slap this over your heel. Like that. And then you have some plastic rub in there instead of regular cloth. That is an easy way to prevent rubbing, friction, and blisters. And make your hike and survivor or whatever else much more enjoyable. <laughs>